Hey! Hi! Yeah. You see Rebecca over here? Hi. My knee hurt. We just finished double dutching. Y'all can see I can't breathe. Too bad you won't see my successful attempt. Woo. I am exhausted. I'm about to go home. That was a quick shoot. Did you purposefully put me up in the day because you didn't want to work my babysitter? No. Yes, of course, Angel. You know how I feel about, you know, babysitters and stuff. I want to make life easy for you. But, uh, Kevin, nobody asked you to do it. Well, yeah, but I, you know. I am a team player. That, but the, you here. That's, I know you. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, I know you're a team player. That's I you said, 315. I said, Kev told him, don't use that chick. She got too many No, kids. you know too many black stuff. This is all about not knowing black stuff. You know almost everything. Oh, okay. Well, then, yeah. That's yeah, the problem. That's all it was. That's the problem. I, know, I would work you all day if I could. <laughs> all right. Let me get out of here. What's up, Kylas? Up, Thank you for my burrito. Praise the Lord, everybody. That chick angel. That chick angel. Angel. That chick angel. Angel. A boss, a wife, a boy, my me. Yo, she's comedy. Come get your life. What's good? Good morning. Look at how greasy I am. I haven't put on any makeup. I'm fresh faced today. It is Thursday, 8, 15, 8, 10, something like that. We're shooting the final day for season one of the Real Comedian Challenge show exclusively on the Kev on Stage Studios app. Um, I don't know what this dance place is that we're at, but in North Hollywood in um, Los Angeles, there are a bunch of dance studios. I've been to a lot of them, especially during my heyday of dancing. Um, so uh, it's called Heart Street Productions, actually. So we're gonna be filming here all day. Yesterday we filmed and we were, we filmed, yeah, we filmed until um, seven o'clock. Tony Baker is here. moving these cones so he can park. Uh huh. No, don't he can fit in between those because somebody else might park in that spot. I was about to say, you could have left those because somebody might try to park right there. We are all here. This is what Tony be driving. Now I'm trying to figure out. Sabrina's supposed to be watching my kids for today. How she getting to my kids? Let's find that out right now. What's up you guys? Happy Friday. Today has already been a doozy. Come in high! Come in high! Y'all can't even see me, so there we go. So I'm at Transit Studios today. We are shooting more content for the app. There's a... Angel says she's moved to Atlanta. I didn't say that. Yes, you did. You said you thought about it. No, I said I thought about leaving. I didn't say where I was going. Angel said leave, she thought about yeah. leaving LA. Nah, man. You was about to leave? No, I wasn't. Let me, tell you, was on the trip. let me tell you, Sir Frederick, let me even get a whiff that a moving truck is coming anywhere near your house. All I'm doing is moving. And I will take my husband's knife and I will flatten every tire. Oh, Marcus got a real knife. We got, got real knives. You hear me? <laughs> There's Mr. Baker. Uh, um, oh, I don't think I can have all my in here. What, okay. do do? what are we get? What is going on? We got cameras. Yo, this is. I've never like, seen this. There's our like fearless this. director. <laughs> there's Crystal the with the fresh fold box. Right. I've never Mr. seen this room look like this. She keeps us in line. Keeps us on time. I got both of my eyelashes on today. Y'all did a whole audition yesterday. Didn't know one of my eyelashes had fallen off until I edited it. And I had to tell them to give the note to casting. Angel looks weird because she didn't know one of her eyelashes fell off. that was part of the character. It, it, Your character's eyelash would have fell off. It's going to have to be a part of the character because that's what I sent them. Mm -hmm. That's, and it that's was, what it is. It's a role that I actually really would love to play. Hey. So we'll see. I want to do more dramas, Angel. You would be phenomenal at it. You Does your agent not? Dramas? Huh? You know who's doing a lot of dramas now? George Lopez. Uh, yeah. But you know what? A lot of comedians transition over mm -hmm. to that. Once they've hit the, hi the height of like having their own sitcom, having yeah. specials go well, I feel like that's when they decide, let me stretch myself. Yeah, and, they do drama. and they typically do phenomenal because oh, most yeah. comedians are great at dramas. 
So yeah, I want you to do more dramas, Tony. Yeah. Tell your people who's submitting you for auditions. I'm starting drama. Thank you. I know you said you were doing August Wilson and stuff. Mm -hmm. I know. I can tell. I know an artist when I see one. I'm not blind. Man, I would love D-Ray's role in Snowfall. Oh, the walk behind and the get shot and mm -hmm. say a couple of lines yeah. and just get That's that it. check, go home. I get that. Yeah. Yeah, D-Ray is living a, He's living his best life. <laughs> he is. So now I'm here with my sister, Quinn, and Mr. Richie Loco. Y'all are going to really love this content. It's so funny. Uh, we're having a blast. We acting a fool. You know, it's what to do for a living. Act a fool. I love it. For those of y'all who are going to ask me, because I know you will, this is Too Faced Melted Matte in the color. It is happening. Come on. Is the color. It's happening. I said it's popping and it's called it's happening. It's because you know. I'm also going to say, I'm going to let Instagram know right now. So we just came back from lunch. We had tender greens, and your girl had two meals. Because I knew my body was going to break it down so quick. I literally yesterday, when they asked me to place my order, I said, I can tell you right now, I know I'm going to be hungry when we eat. <laughs> and I don't want y'all to give me one of these little Millie Mouse, Minnie Mouse foods. Okay, I don't want it. I want some heartiness. So I had some seared ahi and some chicken breast grilled. Okay, I had a little bit of rice, some greens, uh, you know, a little salad. And then I did have a little bit of a heartier mashed potato. And that sealed it in. So your girl's gonna be good because we're gonna be shooting for a long time. And listen, if Angel's hungry, Angel ain't gonna act right for you. Angel gonna be a straight up, you know what the word is. I ain't gonna spell it. Y'all know what it is. So, uh, oh, here is Creature Lawson. Almost close. What's up? Say hello. Hey, you do a vlog? What up, though? Yes, this is a vlog. What's up, though? What's Please go though? follow me. Uh -huh. All the social medias, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, <laughs> Tinder, black people meet. I'm single. Why won't you text me back? That's my own thing. I feel like I'm a good guy. <laughs> Why won't you text me right, back? Though, I'm sure there's some people out there. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, where's Kevin? Taking all along, setting up the stream. He ain't oh, setting up no stream. Just water on camera, cause I'm thirsty. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cause I'm thirsty. Yeah. So look at how pretty this is. Look at how pretty this is. One for each side. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I need it. Cause she could, she could smell it from the That was the established number. I don't know. That was the established number. Thank you. I need to. Kevin is taking forever. You would think that he wasn't the boss the way he acts. He is the boss, but he what? picked that I mean, forever. you mentioned it. You mentioned that it. That is so random. Right. Some people think you're too bad. The way you <laughs> we're live. Because I was looking at him. I was no, like, well. If you wanted to see this, you need to be a part of Kevin's Patreon. Oh, I had my mic on the whole find about time. And Kevin on stage. Oh, my God. I'm crazy, bro. I've been getting. Yeah. Angel said she's moving. I and did. I'm sick of it. So Kevin said he's moving to Atlanta. I don't know if you all know this. Well, maybe it was a, a Patreon exclusive. He's moving to um, Atlanta. He's moving to Atlanta? Yes. Oh, so you don't want them to know. Okay, I'll believe it out. He's moving. So we're talking about it. Okay, we're getting on stage. I got to go. Okay, but he's moving. I was going to, yeah, I'm out. Y'all, I'm going to show y'all some crap. You see my car? There's my car. Why are these people parking in front of my car? Look, look at all this space. Look at where I, I, there's all the space to park. And they parked in front of my truck. They, they see how dusty that thing is. They know when one of these new cars. They could have they parked right here. I tell you. I tell you. Oh my gosh, you just made my it whole weekend and week and month. Oh my goodness, you're a Marcus every day shows up on time with a huge smile on his face. But the part that really gets me, because I'm a mom too, mm -hmm. is the love and patience he has for his little brothers. <laughs> yes, because you see them in the background just going crazy. Yes. Yeah. He is the most amazing person. He takes care, he's not even distracted. That's how, why I'm so amazed with him. He just, he takes care of them. 
You must have a little baby. Yes, the baby will sometimes come busting up in there as well. Plus the twins. I do feel for oh him because I know it's a lot of distractions. And originally we had him away from them, but we're uh, in the middle of selling our house. So we've had to keep the main part of the house kind of clear for inspectors and stuff. And I have been right. very shocked at how well he's been able to like focus in because I know the twins are just they are just a handful on their own and then oh, I know <laughs> they were in the video today and he is so good your baby the littlest one uh -huh. has fell asleep on Marcus's lap oh and he carries him and this is why it's so impressive because oftentimes kids are distracted by family pets mm -hmm. by their family member and goodness what else is you know whatever right. they're doing at home Marcus takes care of your littlest mm -hmm. and when he's falling asleep he carries him ever so gently <laughs> and places him down wherever it's safe yes. but oh my gosh it catches my heart he's a oh my goodness heart. you have a great thank you, have a great you. Person there. thank Aww. you i always tell the kids like if we could all just wish to have a brother like Marcus. <laughs> he is. He's a gem. He's like, a he knows. And I tell him all the time. I'm like, you set your brothers up. I was like, because he's always just been a... The, I thought I was going to be one and done because he was such a good baby and child. I was like, I know I'm not going to get two of you. So I don't know why I would do this oh to my myself. <laughs> more kids. But, but you he, have a great, great sibling as a role model I yes. mean, that he is more than just a sibling role model mm -hmm. it's just a yeah. good human he is he good. is that I, I thank you oh. so much that's, and truly that's what I've always uh, that's what we've always told him We're, I've always been like well I do care about your grades and I want you to do well I was like I really just want to make sure I'm raising good humans in the world because I was like there's a lot of smart jerks and I just I, I'd oh, rather yeah. I said I'd rather you try your best even if it's not you know better than everybody else but for you to be a good person I, I, I'm telling you that means way more to me so the fact that he is that person to his core just blesses my whole little heart oh oh yeah his dad once I tell his dad this oh no telling what this boy's about to get because his father's probably gonna be like okay so we'll be buying you because you listen teachers calling to tell you you're a good student <laughs> we don't take that lightly I don't call I just finished listening to 220 video recordings of all the kids and I said, and I have to tell you, I shared your child's story with my husband who's also a teacher. Oh, wow. And every single time, if there's a kid I want to mention, it's Marcus. Oh. Just the care he has for his siblings who's who wants his attention and he yes. does it so politely yes oh yes. man they do they he, look he, up to he you he warms my heart oh thank he you thank you mm -hmm. you have just made the whole family we about to celebrate this one thank you so much for the call <laughs> I do. I appreciate it, well, and I know he'll appreciate it too to hear that you see that in him. He's definitely going to be beaming, smiling from ear to oh. ear. Oh, good. Good. Have a wonderful weekend. You too. And I'll uh, talk to you in your future. Okay. okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye, bye. So we are at a park right now in our car because we are about to compete in. Here's a brave team. Yes, we of are one brave adult and, and three, three kids. kids. Uh, we're about to do a scavenger hunt around the valley. Uh, this is something put together by my girlfriend's organization, Zawadi Cultural uh, Connection. No, Zawadi Cultural Exchange Collective. Zawadi Cultural Collective. I was like, what is the word? In Black in the Valley, which is an uh, online group that she started. And so uh, we will be competing in our cars, taking pictures, trying to get all the clues. So we're going to see what happens. These are my teammates, Kai Sai and Amar. Lord help us. Lord help us. So my confidence. All the way down. And then there's some more. Hey! Got some more competition over here. But all that matters is that I'm winning. Uh, this is gonna be fun.
Uh, got to see one of my homegirls. It's so weird. I haven't seen so many people in so long. Uh, my car is so loud. We gotta figure out what's going on with that. long luxurious hair in all colors whether it's red weed whether you want a fade or faux locks come on down to superstar hair located in studio city it's black owned and it's amazing do you all give it two thumbs up two thumbs up from tanksley pride superstar are reporting live outside of the black owned black in the valley restaurant black house where's the sign black house you can see it right there they have a yummy treat serving breakfast and lunch all day uh with new hours from 11 a.m to 10 p.m you should come out it's their grand opening have you all eaten here yet say yes was it delicious it was. It was absolutely delicious. They uh, allow you to eat outside via the COVID, uh, the COVID guidelines of Los Angeles, California. And this is Angel Tinksley of the Tinksley Pride reporting live. <laughs> Come on, go. <laughs> Ow! Now spin. Oh, spin. Spin, Kai. Good job, smooth criminal. Move, move. That chick angel, that chick angel, angel, that chick angel, angel. A boss, a wife, a boy, my me. Yo, she's comedy. Come get your love. So glad you asked. I'm talented and funny with a whole lot of class. Watch me juggle my jam pack life, whether it's Hollywood or being Tank's wife. Heavy heart stolen by the apples of my eye. Got a Mar, little Marcus, and my twin.